and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm joined with a very wriggly little teddy and I'm going to be changing him into a sleep suit that I've got from Next. It's just this one with little bears on him because I always call him a teddy bear uh, and I need to tame his crazy fluffy curls. So that is the plan. So I'm going to get him undressed. Um, I've had Teddy a while. I bought him secondhand off a woman on Facebook um, for a really good price, actually. I was really chuffed with how much uh, it was. However, when he did get to me, I found that he was in... He wasn't in the best condition, and that's why I bought him, and I knew that he wasn't in the best condition, but I really loved his kit, uh, and I think he's really, really sweet. So I had him repainted um, and the woman, I'm not going to tell you who my name was because she did a terrible job um, and she didn't, okay, so my problem with this was she didn't actually repaint him. Um, I definitely could see that she had re-varnished him um, but she hadn't actually done his paint again and that's why I'd asked, I'd asked for him to be fully redone um, because I didn't like the colour of him. Uh, he had a lot of flaws um, that I didn't like. Like he was very blue around the mouth and there was a lot of things that I just didn't like about him. Uh, and I was absolutely gutted <laughs> uh, when I got him back. So we went back into storage and then I was in my storage bins one day and I found all his limbs and found him and I just looked at him and I thought there's no point in me having him just laying under a bed for the rest of eternity. Um, so I decided that it was time to get him redone um, and I contacted the crazy doll woman Amy on Facebook, uh, on Instagram and she was really kind and said, yep, yeah, send him across, I'll fix him up. And my goodness, did she fix him up. Look how beautiful he is painted now. His little feet are gorgeous, his limbs. I absolutely love his head now. He's just, he looks so much better than he did when um, the other lady had him. And I kind of wish I'd just sent him straight to Amy beforehand. Um, I don't know what I was thinking. But he is now all done. And I don't get him out often enough because he is so lovely to take photos of. And he's so cute in his little expression with his little sucky lip. Um, but she did great. And I kept his hair the same because I really like his little fuzzy, fluffy hair. And she also kept his eyes the same for me because I did. That was the reason I wanted him was I, I completely fell in love with his eyes. Uh, I thought the colours were just beautiful. They're like a, a greeny blue. They were just beautiful glass eyes. So I decided that I wanted to keep those. And um, yeah, she has done a really good job. Um, I have a few open-eyed kits now. There was one point, and if anyone used to follow my original channel, um, I took it down... I don't know, I want to say in like 2018 I took it down. It might have been after that, I'm not really sure. Um, you'll know that I used to have a thing where I used to really dislike... Oh, sorry, buddy. Uh, Open-eyed kits. I used to think they were scary. <laughs> I don't know why. Um, and I'd never want them in my collection. And then I started to fall in love with different babies... Um, and appreciate the artistry behind them more. Uh, I do have a baby um, that I need to have. I need to get her a new body. Um, so she is in storage currently just because she needs a new body. And then I've got a baby, a special baby that I'm going to be talking about when I'm doing my collection my updated collection tour, which I'm hoping to do uh, over the weekend. Oh my goodness, this is up to one month and this is a little bit, it's a little bit tight on you, sir. It's a bit too perfect. Um, yeah, so she needs a new body. And then I've got a baby that 
I absolutely freaking love, but she's having some work done on her hands because she's got open hands. Um, and she was a gift from Shell. Um, but I'm terrified of ruining her fingers. So she's been sent to have some um new varnish put on her hands. And she's also got some little dimples, which I really love. Um so I do have a few few things on the way. Look how cute he looks. Oh Teddy, you're so sweet. He's just so cuddly. He looks like he just needs a cuddle. Um I'm going to try and tame his hair now, but I don't actually, I'm not entirely sure if this will tame <laughs> in the the easiest way. So I'm just going to pop him this way. Look at how crazy his hair is. <laughs> I didn't want to reboot him because I just thought, you know what? I don't have any babies with this kind of craziness going on. Um, so what I'm going to do, he has... I call it um noodle hair. Like he looks like he's got ramen noodle hair or super noodle hair if you're in the UK. Uh, I'm just going to give it a brush because he's not been I'm going to be honest, he's not been sitting on any f um what's it called? Um he hasn't been sitting up with anything protecting his hair. So it is really, really fluffy. So I just want to give it a bit of a brush to get rid of any knots. And I've just used a bit of distilled water like I usually do. Just... And then once I've done... Once I've done is a brush out just because I need to make sure it's all untangled I'm gonna go back in with the water just all over so it's sopping in a sense and I'm going to then do what I like doing so this is what I do with Teddy's hair I just push it with a finger um, just to make it bounce up a bit so it's like little noodles recoil in a sense Bless him. Bless him, bless him, bless him. Um, and then that helps with his little fluffiness. I'll just give it a little push. I'm no expert, guys. Like, just tip him over a second so I can see the back. Uh, I am no, no expert in reborn hair whatsoever. But I do my best to make sure that I look after it. And um, my really high-end dolls, well, I say high-end, but my more expensive dolls, they never leave... Um, a silk pillow or anything like that because I'm too terrified to ruin their hair but Teddy is a really cuddly little guy but I just love his little fluffy curly hair so look at him look how cute he looks now he looks perfect in my eyes maybe we should pick him out a dummy um yeah so had a lot going on over this last week I'm just getting my little um box of dummies out so I can sort of have a little look through see if there's any I can't remember if he has a magnet oh he does I forgot about his magnet how, how could I forget about his magnet oh look at him go you need a bigger one than that my sir let's see if I can find you a better dody Hmm. None of those are magnetised. What about this one? Oh yes, lovely. I like that one. We'll go for that one. Um. Oh, yeah. So let's just make sure. Oh my goodness, I'm so noisy. Uh, so this is little Teddy, and. I just love him. I just think he looks so stinking cute. I'm definitely going to take some photos of him now. Because I think he needs a little photo shoot because he's not had one in a while. Um, and he is going to come out with me this weekend. I'm going to put him in the carrier and take him out for a walk. Uh, just because I think that he needs one. He's not seen the outside before. So I think it's Teddy's turn to go outside and have a little look around. <laughs> Bless him. Um, 
but I mentioned in yesterday's video that I am waiting for a doll and I am waiting for uh, a toddler and I'm waiting for that kit to arrive to our artist and oh we've had no one's oh, stress with it um but I might do a video on that I'm gonna give the seller of the kit uh till next week to sort of fix the issue and if not then I'll come and ask for a bit of advice um on here because you guys are so supportive but I hope you like Teddy yeah I think he's a either a love or a hate kind of kit especially with his expression um so you'll have to let me know how you feel about him I think he's beautiful <laughs> but I guess that's all that matters isn't it really because he's in my collection as my baby so I guess that is all that matters but he's just so sweet <laughs> Uh, thank you for watching this video guys. Uh, I'll be filming a, another video over the weekend just to show you my collection and give you a bit of an update on everything and I hope you continue to like, comment and subscribe to my channel and enjoy watching my videos even if you don't subscribe like I'm just really happy that someone's enjoying the content that I'm putting out because I'm enjoying the content the content I'm putting out and I think that's really important uh, that I enjoy it so yeah you've all been amazing I can't wait to do this update of my collection I think it'll be interesting because I've just not seen them all together before in a while um, I've had a lot of changes since then so thank you very much for watching and I will see you shortly bye guys